Hey, hi, hello there! Welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial video. In this video, we do a crazy mod mashup, and it's dedicated to my Dragon Ball Z and Naruto fans. I'll be showing you how to play Dragon Ball Z and Naruto Z together in a single Minecraft world. You're a Super Saiyan, and I'm some chump Namekian trying to act like Naruto, man. As always, if you found this video to be helpful, please smash the like button and subscribe to the channel for more tutorial updates. With that said, let's get to it. Now this video is really intended for people that have already played Dragon Block C and installed Forge or Naruto C. So if you want an in-depth tutorial on how to do that, please see the links below. But I will go really quickly on how to install it and then I'll show you how to set it up. To get started, let's go to the Jink Games download page. You could do that by clicking the link provided in the descriptions below. Or in the address bar type dl.jinngames.net just like this. From there, scroll down to the download section. Now from here, we want to install the first four mods, the JRM Core Mod, GBR8 Client, Dragon Block C, Naruto C. Simply right click, open new tab, click the download button and close that new tab up and do the same exact thing with the remaining three mods. Now open up your downloads folder and you should see all four mods download in that folder. Next, we want to place these in the Minecraft folder. Press the window key and the R key at the same time on your keyboard and type the following in your run window. From there, find the mods folder. If you don't see it, you just need to install and run Forge at least once. More on that later, you'll want to drag the four mods from your downloads folder into this mods folder. Now let's open up the Minecraft launcher. Make sure you have Forge 1.7.10 selected and installed. If you don't, you'll need to install Forge by Googling Forge 1.7.10 clicking the first link and clicking on the recent version installer to download. All right, in the launcher, go ahead and click play to run Minecraft. Click into the mods menu and do a quick check to see that we have Dragon Block and Naruto C loaded. And we do. Now from here, I wanna show you how weird having both mods can get. So go into single player and create a new world. Now in creative mode, you can see we have both Dragon Block C items and Naruto items to choose from. So let's go ahead and uh, give this guy some swanky Naruto drip, orange drip right here. Now you want to go ahead and click V to turn on your character selection menu. And this is where you pick your path. So either go Naruto story or Dragon Block C story. And you do that by clicking the chakra power element or the key power element. We'll get to that in a second. You just click next over here. And you can see that you change the power type from natural to key to then chakra. Okay, and then you click next. Click accept. And there we go. Look at us. Yeah, we got an Emekian in the Naruto world. Isn't that freaking weird? It's pretty amazing. All right, from here, open up your menu. See like all the different things you typically would see in the storyline. You see that you're in the Naruto C storyline. Just click start. I just wanna show you like, I'm gonna get by real quick, but I wanna show you that once you die, you don't just respawn. You actually go to the other world to see King Yama. It is freaking weird. But this is what happens when you start combining both mods. You get, you know, a little bit of both. So, you know, you can revive yourself the classic five minutes. But you know, you got the, the Namekian doing the Naruto run. And yeah, that's, uh, that's how it is. Now we're gonna redo that, create a new world, and let's go down the Dragon Block C path. So now we'll select the Frieza character and we'll change the type to key and click next. And we're still in an Naruto drip over here. You know, other than that, we still have Dragon Block C powers and everything you expect. So you got key technique, saga system from here. You can start the Dragon Block C mode. All right, so now let's see what happens when you combine them both together in a server. I, I was distracted, why is he kicking around like that? That did nothing. That did nothing. Let me show you how it's done. Let me show you how it's done. There you go. Dude, you're weak. You're a Super Saiyan, and I'm some chump Namekian trying to act like Naruto, man. I don't know. What's your deal? You gotta get a little bit better. Dude, how weak are you? I am apparently very weak. Ah, my punch is weird. I don't think that worked. Why? I don't know. Oh, are you supposed to kill him? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm supposed to kill him. <laughs> I think that's how it works. Dude, one. Dude, did you just kill him again? Are you kidding me? All right. Good to know that I need to kill him. That was some blast I did. So you just, you stay put. Did you just throw down a throne, dude? Yeah, I was gonna sit down and just watch. <laughs> what? What did he do? No, my throne! <laughs> okay, fantastic. So good to know I need to kill him, not you. We made a mess. Look at this place. Is heck. Yo, come here. Come here, cat. Cat. Cat, come over here. Oh. What do I do? Oh, killed I, one. I killed one too. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Oh, oh. That didn't kill him anymore. I didn't look that. <laughs> He's a beast. Dude, what is this guy doing? Come here. Don't run away from the Namekian. I'm literally the worst ninja on, on earth. You know what? Not even worth it. That chicken right there is more royal than you are. Why can't I see it? I don't know. You tell me. Okay, okay, it doesn't matter. Could you, could you start the mission, please? I'm ready to roll. Oh, oh, we got Vegeta. Yo, yo, he's looking at me. I don't like it. 
Come here, buddy. Fucking nasty. Oh, I missed it. So I hit him. I switched my game mode. Ready? Oh. Oh, you're dead. I can hear it. No. So he just appeared. Cool. Why? He just killed you. And connection was lost. Oh god, that was horrible. Fantastic. I think that ends it right there.